Welcome to the Hartzell Composite Facility. At this building, we produce thousands of composite blades for aircraft every year. We use two main processes for that. The first is what we call a legacy process, which uses prepreg carbon and Kevlar that has resin already injected into the material. And those are laid up over a core and then put into a mold and a press where it's heated and put under pressure and cured for multiple hours. While it's in that press, the resin starts to flow and the blade, as it cooks in the mold, solidifies and becomes a finished blade. After that, the blade is taken to the process where we clean it up and get it ready to be primed and painted and put into inventory. Our other process for composite blades is called our next-gen resin transfer process where we use dry carbon socks instead of prepreg material and overlay those onto a core as well and co-mold with it an erosion shield on a leading edge for protection from all kinds of foreign object damage. So that process is a dry carbon layup and then the blade is co-molded with the leading edge and it's also put under pressure and the resin is vacuum pumped into the blade as it cures over a four to eight hour period. Those blades come out and they're also taken and primed and ready for paint. And then they are sent up to our main assembling and manufacturing facility where they're put in inventory and ultimately get put into propellers. So the carbon fiber we use is aerospace grade. It's absolutely the strongest material you can think of when it comes to composite blades. And we really use that to differentiate our product because it allows us to design thinner airfoils with wider cords that really outperform any other product in the market. Throughout a typical year, we produce about 2,000 to 2,500 composite blades, and those go into aircraft from anything from the Red Bull Air Races to big regional airliners who are depending on us to provide very strong structural composite blades that last a lifetime. In fact, some of our blades have more than 50,000 accumulated hours, and the great thing about structural composite from a life cycle standpoint is that you can continue to overhaul those blades and restore them to their original factory specifications and not grind away material like you do on a metal blade. So theoretically, you can continue to overhaul blades on the composite side and restore them to new and get unlimited life out of them, which is what they're certified for. Aero TV is brought to you by Redbird Flight Simulations is dedicated to revolutionizing flight training by designing, manufacturing, and delivering affordable and innovative flight training technologies. Each Redbird device is designed to enhance the training experience for pilots of all levels, from student to ATP. Redbird is quickly becoming the industry standard for flight training. Since Redbird introduced its revolutionary FMX in 2007, colleges, universities, and flight training operations around the world have integrated Redbird products into their curriculum. It's time to discover what Redbird can do for you. Join the migration.